According to International Energy Agency's data, buildings are responsible for 36% of the total CO2 emissions and 40% of total energy consumption, and the relationship between buildings and energy impacts a broad spectrum from strategic to operational concerns, including energy efficiency investment decisions, buildings energy performance management, energy efficiency policies, smart buildings, and energy desegregation. Therefore, energy efficiency data in buildings becomes key to many practical decision-making contexts by households, academics, or policymakers. A first review of the building's efficiency data revealed that part of the data needed by users is only accessible by the creators or owners. Moreover, we suggest to design means of keeping the data accessible also after project lifetimes. Concerning building's energy efficiency data, there are also severe limitations to findability as most data is kept locally. Interoperability is also significantly affected from different and in some cases unexploitable data structures such as qualitative in text or audio format. The reusability of data is impacted by privacy concerns. Limitations exercised by data sources, missing data, multiplicity, and scattered nature of data sources including households, industries, utility companies, municipalities, as well as how well the data characteristics are defined and reported. The openness of data also comes in a significant drawback, mainly due to restrictions arising from commercial and security concerns. The first one is to incorporate the fair and open principles into the design process. The second one is to utilize of larger platforms for hosting data instead of smaller individual projects platforms. The third one is to promote community platforms for hosting domain-specific data. And finally, user-centric design of data and data practices and processes. To identify and address the challenges associated with the privacy concerns, ethics, and data protection requirements. To establish procedures and standards pertaining to the processes involving the design, generation, processing, and sharing of data, so that these processes produce fair data while respecting the ethical privacy and data protection concerns. Moreover, we suggest to design means of keeping the data accessible also after project lifetimes. We suggest to focus on community or domain-wide standardization, integrate or establishing common repositories for similar databases, and also utilizing repositories for metadata augmentation. First, to user-centric design of data and data practices and processes, promote trust within the community and the democratization of knowledge, accomplish an a prior awareness and consensus regarding both the value that can be generated out of fair data and the cost of fair data 